Hi and hello, welcome back. Jana here. I have a new layout and um, I'm using a cut file and a large um, hand stitch title. And um, yeah, I'm starting with my background um, because of the um, disaster from uh, the last time. I thought um, it would be much easier to um, color the background before I'm adding my stitching. Yay! And um, I'm scrapping a picture of the little one and his uh, only from his hands and he is um, making a little heart with his hands and um, yeah, the title is Love is in the Air and so I wanted to have um, the background airy, lighty, bluey and yeah, something um, like a sky. Yeah. And I'm using um, acrylic paint and gesso and a bit of water and I'm using um, some packaging to smush the color around. And uh, here I'm just adding a tiny bit uh, more blue so I um, for two different colors on my background paper. Wow, that was um, a hard one. <laughs> I'm sorry. And yeah, I'm just smudging around and um, I will add some splatters and I'm just looking and checking where the cut file will, um, will found a place so I have enough color behind it. And here, um, yeah, and now I'm looking where I want to have the title and where I want to have the cut file um, so that I can start um, stitching. And um, here I'm just secure the um, paper, the print out, whatever, uh, with uh, washi tape so it will uh, stay in place. Yeah. And um, now I'm using a needle to punch a lot of holes. Yes, a lot. And, um, but I will stop here, yeah. And here you can see um, all the little holes I made. And um, yeah, now um, someone asked me about um, the stitching um, and here you can see what I'm doing. I'm just using a big needle and um, some embroidery thread and um, I'm secure the back with some washi tape. And then I will start and I'm just doing the back and forth stitch. I think that's what you will call it. I'm just going back and the next one and then back. It's um, easy peasy, really easy, um, but yeah, the title took me something about um, two hours or maybe two and a half. I'm not pretty sure, but um, yeah, I was running out of uh, white uh, embroidery thread, so I had, a, had to take a break and get to the store and yeah. But I made it and I am very, very happy about um, the looking and how that uh, title turned out. And yeah, like I said, it's very easy, but it's very time con cons consuming. Oh my. But it's so uh, worth the work, really. It's um, something special for your page and it's um, unique and it's totally handmade and I made some mistakes and I um, forgot a few of the holes, but it's totally, um, yeah, it's handmade. It's real. It's, I like it. Yeah, and here, um, the cut file is from the cut shopper from Ashley Horton. And um, I really like the hearts and I wanted to back um, the striped papers with some paper. And that took me a while because I did not find the right papers. And so I turned off the camera and... Um, made that offline but um, yeah you can see what I am um, what I'm using some papers from MET and from um, Schimmel and from Pink Paisley Paige Evans and yeah 
I really um I really like um backing the cut files. It's I am not um doing that very often, but um I will try to do it more, yes. And that layout took me um a while. It uh was not um yeah, I don't know. That was not um it was not flowing. I had to think a lot about um the placement and the colors and what I wanted to have and yeah and here I grabbed um the chipboard flowers from Illustrated Face and I'm cutting out some flowers from that gorgeous paper. And um yeah, I really like um the flowers. Um first when I was planning the layout, I did not plan any flowers. I wanted to have a boy page and um, that picture and the title and some hearts and, but I don't know. Um, yeah, I totally love um, the direction or the way the layout turned out. Yeah. And I'm adding some leaves also from that paper and um, yeah, it's just um yeah, I I I'm totally uh, in love with that layout. And now I will add some hearts and um that little circle with love. And the blue chipboard heart is also um saying love, but it's totally fine. Love is in the air, so I will have love stickers and hearts and yeah and here I wanted to use more pink there are blue hearts and green hearts but I wanted to have pink maybe because of the flowers or maybe because of the the power of the color if you understand what I mean it's um yeah it's um yeah I don't know I'm sorry I don't know and here I'm adding some uh, tiny word stickers uh, from Tim Holtz. Holtz? Tim Holtz? Yeah. And um, yeah, I'm just looking through the stickers and um, on that point I realized I wanted to have something on the other side. Maybe a paper, but no. I was totally clueless. I had no idea, no... Yeah. But um yeah, I will I will make um I will make it and I am so happy about um yeah, my cleverness. No, <laughs> I'm I'm kidding. But you will see what I mean. I'm, and here I'm um adding a layer or two layers behind my picture. Just some tissue paper and a tag and that is uh, the tag is from the Fancy Free collection from Paige Evans and Pink Paisley. Yep. And now I will grab my glue and will start to um, glue everything down. And that took me a while. And I turned off the camera to um, peel off the backing from the glue dots because that's the boring part. And I don't want it to. Um, yeah, have you, um, yeah, you know, I don't want it to, to get, uh, to, <laughs> bah. um, never mind. Uh, here you can see I am adding the flowers and the leaf directly to my uh, layers and, um, I'm just gluing that corner down and now I'm, yeah, I'm adding the stickers, the chipboard pieces and, um, the leaves and yeah nothing more to say <coughs> I'm sorry sorry um yeah and yeah and um I'm adding more pop dots dimension pets and um, yeah, 
just gluing gluing the flowers down and um, have a fight with the backing from that chipboard piece. And yeah, I'm um, very, very happy about um, about the page. The stitching is, um, like I said before, it's um, a lot of work, but it's so worth the work. And um, yeah, you should give it a try, really. And oh yeah, the font I'm using, or I just... Um, is uh, bro mellow. I will link you this time. I'm. I promise. I will link you. And yeah, that was my first try to add something to the other side from the title. And um, yeah, I'm adding some tiny animal dots in pink, and they are from Laura Barora or something like that. I'm sorry if I spelled that wrong. Um, yeah, animal dots. And then I think I will now turn off the camera to cut off the excess. And then, bam, I got the perfect idea. There was one heart. And look, yes, perfect. And I will um, add that paper to the background from the heart. Or the, I will back that heart on that paper. And that paper is from Chimel from the... Starshine or star, something like star collection. And um, yeah, popping that up and adding. And I, I, got, I got some new flares from Fidiocraft and I wanted to use the pink one that said here. I think it's here. But I, um, I can't get that. Um, did not work. No, it did not work. And I'm grabbing a heart. And a darker one. I don't know why, but um, I needed a darker heart on that side. And I'm adding one last piece, one last piece, yeah, one chipboard flower. And I am done. Yes. Trying to add the flare, but no, I'm sorry. Um, yeah, last flower and I am done. And I am in love with that page. So... Um, thank you so much for watching, yes, for watching, and uh, welcome to my su new subscribers and um, all your lovely comments, and you make me happy. Bye!